Hello. Hello, Michael. How are you, teacher? Great. How are you? I am great. Thank you. Okay. So today I'm just going to ask you a few questions, and we'll have a mini conversation. Okay. Of course. Okay. Here is the question: Why do you study English? What is the purpose? Uh huh. Uh -huh. I yeah. <laughs> I found a job abroad uh, one years ago, and then uh, I decided for learn English. Uh huh. I have been studying English uh, for one years. Okay, and so your yes. your your purpose is with your job, with your occupation. That's right. Yes, for my job. Uh huh. And did you study English when you were a child, when you were a kid? Yes, uh, but uh, not so much. Uh, when I was a student, uh, I think I remember uh, two two hours uh, a week. Ah, and yeah, not so much, right? Yes, yes. Okay. So I need to improve my English. Uh, I went uh, English course in Istanbul. Okay, good. That's my next and question. How are you studying English? Uh, study. Uh, no, I am uh, study uh, with myself, my own. But before I study at a special uh, school. Uh huh. But uh, I want to. Uh, I think uh, I have to uh, go again at the uh, special school. Okay, so you oh. have a you have a plan for the future. Yeah. About learning English, right? Yes, yes. I have a plan. Uh, I decided uh, again. I decided uh, one or two months later I will start uh, at English school. Okay. Uh huh. Wonderful. Yeah. Well, I, I wish you luck. Thank you so much. And, and not just luck, but success. I wish you a lot of success. Yes, yes. Uh, no, I cover my all, all life with English. Okay, it's good. Yes, I uh, I uh, I am following uh, so uh, so many page in Instagram. I have a lot of group uh, on Facebook, and then uh, I I made uh, so many friends uh, from Filipina, from Thailand, from other country. When I decided to learn English, uh, I think I have to working like a madman. <laughs> uh -huh. Right, because it depends on you. Right, no one can do it for you. Yes, yes. I know. I know uh, some of my friend. Uh, they are study maybe three years, but not like me speaking English. Uh huh. Okay. Yes. It depends. It depends. People, if uh, people people uh, want to uh, real real learn English, they they are uh, should study hard working. Sure. Okay. Yes. All right. Well, but you are you are so uh, good teacher. Uh, I am not uh, speaking uh, simple. I am speaking hard. You are really uh, so. Uh, you have a so useful page. You help all people because you. If you have a free time, uh, I think you make uh, like this life. It is so good for uh, for students. For like me, students, because we need to learn English. English language is so important in the world. Uh, if you want to go abroad, if you want to make uh, some good things in your in uh, your life, you should learn English. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, like, uh, thank you so much to you and like uh, you, uh, teacher. Thank you, and thank you for yeah. coming. Thank you for coming live. I'll probably It's my pleasure. See you in the future, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Thank All you right. so much, Dr. Welling. Thank you. Bye-bye.
Bye bye. Thank you, Michael. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Great. I think you've come live before, right? Yes. Yes. Right. Ah, because with the sunglasses you look a little different. No, no, it's okay. <laughs> ah. Okay. That time I uh, was wearing sunglasses, but another one. Ah. Okay. Well, welcome back. Uh, today I'm going to ask you a couple questions about how you study. Okay. Mhm. Mm about okay. English. Okay. So yes. first question is probably maybe the most important. Why? Why do you study English? What is your goal? Mhm. Mm No, as the first goal, um, uh, when you learn English, when you speak English, you can uh, get a good job, you can travel, you can study, and you uh, you can do everything you want. It's it's like freedom. Knowledge uh -huh. English is like freedom. And is your number one goal to like lifestyle, or is it more professional? Uh, my uh, goal was uh, to go abroad, and uh -huh. uh, I did it. I went to USA, and it uh, was my did, first. Goal. Did you say was it Ohio? You said before. Uh, yes. Uh -huh. I yeah. remember. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Nice. <laughs> sorry, sorry to interrupt. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> no. And now I'm uh, learning Polish because I'm in Polish now. Uh -huh. It's it's hard when I start to uh, speak English with customers, with client. When in my work, it's very hard to uh, change uh, uh, language because I think in Russian, I speak Polish, and then I need to uh, I need to talk uh, to speak English, and it's like mix in my head. Uh huh. It's like But, a puzzle. Right. Yes. Yes. You're right. Uh -huh. But I love English very much. Not so. Uh, I do not like so uh, so much Polish, uh, Russian, but English is my favorite <laughs> language. Uh -huh. Well, um, I've done some research on people that speak multiple languages, and it's wonderful for your brain power because yes. it it forces your brain to make new connections, solve problems, and figure out things. Yes, you're right. Uh huh. And do you feel that you're improving? Uh, right now, no, because I do not use English, and I want to. It's my um, it's my dream to go uh, one day in USA or, uh -huh. or in Canada, and I hope that English will uh, will be necessary for more for my life. Sure. And currently, how do you study English? But um, I uh, I watch uh, films. I watch uh, serials, serials. The, the T TV series. Uh huh. Uh, yes. yes. Like uh huh. Do you have a favorite? Friends. Everyone likes Friends. I I agree. It's good. Plus the topics they talk about. It's wonderful for vocabulary. And it's funny too, right? So it's easier to learn. Uh huh. Yes, yes, you're right. Right. Okay. Well, thank you for coming live, and thank you for answering my thank questions. You. Thank you. Have a nice okay. day. Okay. You too. Uh -huh. Bye bye. Hello. <laughs> Hi. How are you? <laughs> oh, I'm grateful. <laughs> All right. You sounds like you have a lot of positive energy. <laughs> <laughs> I still can't believe it. <laughs> well, welcome. welcome. Oh, thank you. Thanks for coming live. So I'm just going to oh. ask you a, a few questions, and we'll have a mini conversation, okay? Yeah. Okay. So can you okay. tell me what is your number one goal for studying English? I think my goal, my number one goal is I want to be more cool, better than my friends. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Because and do you go ahead? Me, my friends cannot speak English, and I want to talk with them with English. So I think I will be more cool. <laughs> ah. And is that a short-term goal or a long-term goal? Um, it. I think it's long goal. <laughs> 
All right. Yeah, it depends on you because it's your it's your life, right? And what what are you doing? What tools do you use to study English? I I watch the TV or I watch your video. <laughs> okay. Uh huh. I I also um, learn from book my book. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and then there's. There is English lesson in my school also. Aha. Uh-huh. Aha. Uh-huh. And, and are those sp- speaking lessons or like book lessons or a mix? Oh, uh book book I think it's book book lesson. Aha. Uh-huh. And do, do uh, your friends speak English? No. <laughs> Nothing or a little bit? Yes, little bit. Little bit. Sometimes we talk with English. We mix my first language and English. Uh huh. Uh huh. So do you you practice with your friends in yeah, English? Yeah, of course. But seldom, seldom. And are your friends learning English for the same reason to be cool? <laughs> I think no. <laughs> I think they are not. I think they. Want to make? Uh, wait, wait. I don't know what. Have... I don't know what their goals. <laughs> I don't know what their goals. Uh huh. But my goals is I want to be more cool. <laughs> okay. And do you think? Do you feel that you're improving? Ah. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah. Step, go ahead. No, no. <laughs> sure. So s- step by step. Yeah, step by step. Uh-huh. Like I always. Oh, I'm sad because I cannot speak English well. And there's my friend speak English well, and I can't be like him or her, him. Yeah, him. Uh huh. And. Uh, I I like to tell my students that we don't say I can't speak English well or I can't. Instead, we say I'm improving. My English is improving, right? Yeah. Because if we say we can't, it's like a stop, right? It closes the door. But if we say yeah. we're improving, it's opportunity. Yeah. Uh-huh. If no negativity. <laughs> sure. Sure, we have to have a, a strong mindset because I agree it's difficult to learn a language, but not impossible. Uh-huh. Be- because in my country, English is our fourth fourth language. Okay. So there, yeah, my friends. There are so many my friends can speak English, <laughs> so I, I don't know. With, I don't know. How to practicing my English? Uh huh. Well, there are well because you have an internet connection. The possibilities are almost wow. So many possibilities because you have internet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, of course. Right. So okay, that's why I watch your video. <laughs> sure. Okay. okay. Well, thank you. Thank you for coming live. You're welcome to come back in the future. Okay. Can I take? Photo. <laughs> okay, you mean a screenshot? Oh, of course. Okay, yeah, one, one, two, three. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Have a good, uh, good night. Yeah, good night. <laughs> All right, bye bye. Wow, mm-hmm. wow, Michael, Hello. how are you? I'm fabulous. How are you? I'm fabulous. Nice to meet you. You're great. Again. <laughs> yes. I feel right. better. Okay, so I'm going to ask you a couple questions, and we'll have a mini conversation. Okay. Go on. Okay. I'm yearning. That's great. All right. What is your number one goal for studying English? What is your purpose? So, actually, everything uh, in today's society is. Uh, English related and I can do nothing about it and so this is a 
So we should learn and uh, practice much, uh, uh, much English, and uh, so so that we could uh, use it in our society and in our profession. I mean, career and uh, something like that, and everything is English related. So uh, we should learn it uh, as soon as possible. And can you be more specific? No, uh, I said we should learn it as soon as possible. Right, but can you give a specific example? Uh, okay, uh, so um, uh, actually, I'm plan. Uh, I've been planning to uh, have job in uh, ab abroad, and uh, this is one of my purposes uh, in my life. So, if I, um, I mean. Uh, uh, go through this, uh, so uh, I should learn English. Uh -huh. And uh, uh, I think that's this, just this. So, so the main reason for you is uh, prof your profession, for your occupation? Yes, working, working in abroad and uh, uh, make progress in my career and uh, something like this and nothing much. Sure. Sure. And so how do you study English? What tools do you use? Actually everything. Applications and uh, films, series, books, uh, everything like this. Uh -huh. uh, I use everything to, use, uh, to learn English. And uh, this is, uh, I mean, English is, mo uh, is my cup of tea. <laughs> Great, great. And let's see, if can you give a piece of advice to someone who is just starting to learn English? What would you say to them? So, learn English as soon as it is possible because uh, it is something that uh, we need it. Uh, so, um, if you can't learn it, I can make it to do it. And... <laughs> <laughs> so actually, I had a page like you. I have a page, and it is a it is an active page actually. And uh, I learn English. They, uh, I learn everyone English uh, as uh, uh, I mean uh, how much I can learn English. Uh, I mean, um, how how can I say this? Uh, I learn English. Uh, I teach English to everyone. Uh, by films and series and uh, just this. Sure, sure. Yes. It's kind of like a community, right? There's so many people that want to, and we can uh, boost each other. Mm -hmm. yes, actually, I, uh, I learn uh, people who are lower than me, their level are uh -huh. lower than me. Yes. Uh -huh. I don't know, uh -huh. uh, with this speaking, with this level of speaking, what level... Uh, I have, I don't know, then please feel free to say me my level. Oh, well, that that's not the purpose of the conversation. <laughs> okay. We're just, okay. Yeah, yeah, that okay. would take more time, and that's for a, a different thing, yeah. So, well, thank okay. you for coming live, and thank you for having a conversation with me. That's my pleasure. Thank you. Okay. See you. Bye -bye. Have a wonderful day. Hello. Hello. Hello, Abel. How are, How are you? you? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. What about you? Let's see. Mm, I will be extraordinary. I feel great. Extraordinary? <laughs> sure, extraordinary. Like, oh, it's just like incredible, great, wonderful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I know that. I know, I know this word. Um, yeah, it is good. And sure. also, I'm in a good mood today. So, yeah, yeah, I just want to, you know, uh, attend this uh, conversation. Yeah. Sure. Okay, so I'll ask you a few few questions, and here we go. Uh, the first one, hmm, let's see. What is your number one tool for use, for learning English? Number one tool, yeah, it is quite a difficult question, <laughs> actually. But I think uh, the most useful uh, tool is, you know, uh, the computer, the internet, internet, yeah. 
because you know we can learn many things from the internet and it's also you know we can reach uh, many information easily and something like that so yeah i think i um you know i more often than not you know um, actually hang out in the internet by surfing and something like that yeah uh -huh. okay and what is your number one goal for learning english <laughs> number one goal yeah i'm still a student electrical engineering students man so my goal is you know i think uh, after completing my education uh, i would like to get a job uh, as an electrical engineer in international company and yeah i think it is my goal and actually you know uh, yeah i literally established my whole future plan on this so yeah my my future plan my goal is this yeah great i i um i'm learning something about people my students myself as well is that the more specific our goal the more clearly defined our goal the greater the chance of achieving the goal so if i just say if i like say okay i want to learn english my goal is to learn english is very broad yeah. right it's not very specific but if i say i want to learn english because i need it for a job or i need it because i need to communicate daily with my customers who very specific and i'm finding the more specific the more clear our goals are the greater the chance that we will achieve them what do you think yeah you are right my uh, you are right because yeah i think uh, we you know i somehow say that uh, learning english is my goal yeah you're right so also you know um, yeah i think uh, we can say that so specific specific um yeah yeah i think uh, specifically yeah i can say that my you know my aim my uh, main aim i think is learning english because you know i'm preparing for ielts exam so also you know uh you know i need to i need to many uh, practice so yeah um yeah i'm preparing for ielts exam because you know that uh it's a you know uh, so difficult uh, you know so difficult um exam so yeah i just you know uh i'm planning to take exam take uh, ielts exam on you know uh 28 uh september so uh -huh. <laughs> yeah i just you know uh, i just say that yeah uh huh and what advice would you give to someone who is frustrated <laughs> as they're learning english they feel it's too difficult ah it's frustrating <laughs> what advice would you give okay 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 uh, i'm not an you know i'm not, i'm not an expert uh, or something like that but i can say that to you know to someone who who want to learn english so you should you know you should be patient you should be you know um determined person especially first of all and you know what i think uh, you should study work and uh, you know you shouldn't uh, you know you shouldn't uh, let mistakes uh, spoil your life spoil your uh spoil your you know the process of you know uh, english learning english process so yeah yeah you know as i have cited before i'm not an expert uh you know i'm not an uh, english uh, you know uh, teacher or something like that but i think uh, yeah i think this these things uh, can be done uh for an you know for an uh, for an students or something like that so yeah yeah it's done <laughs> one <laughs> wonderful and i would say sometimes i think experts are overrated <laughs> because oh, yeah. <laughs> and the reason is that you can speak on the subject because you have experience you've done it you've actually went step by step and so you have you're able to give advice based on your own experience right even if not you're not a certified expert you still have valuable advice to give so thank you mm -hmm. yeah yeah uh i'm so thankful uh, for you know joining us joining me to this conversation my uh, you know yeah okay all right well, thanks for coming live and you're welcome to come back in the future yeah yeah inshallah <laughs> in okay. inshallah yeah <laughs> okay yeah, yeah thank you, you. Bye, bye bye yeah hello how are you how are you i'm Great. me i'm fine thank you how are you <laughs> wonderful just can you give me a One second because okay now I'm ready yes okay okay all right let's yeah, see hmm what should i ask all right um uh, how do you feel 
that improving mm -hmm. your level of English will help your life. How I feel? Mm -hmm. To improve my language. When I improve my language, how I feel? Uh, Is this how, question? How, uh -huh. do you, how do you feel that improving mm. your English will help your life? Hmm. <laughs> this is difficult question and different question. I I didn't prepare myself, <laughs> but okay. okay, okay. I feel good because every single day I uh, learning much more thing, and so uh, it is useful, you know, because the world is speaking uh, generally English, and uh, I feel good because I can. Uh, Communicate with uh, foreign foreigners. It's good for me, and sure. this kind of things. Yes, yes, of course. And what what is your plan? What what is What's your plan, plan? Of, your plan of action for studying English? Uh, my plan. Okay, I, I generally don't like uh, to plan, <laughs> but I'm <laughs> using. Uh, just you know i don't have a plan just i watch some uh films to improve my english and if you ask me ask me uh, my, what is my uh, future plan when i sure. learn my english uh, probably uh, i'm studying coach university and so uh, i have to pass equip uh, i have to pass english course to my major and mm -hmm. uh, I want to be a good lawyer in the future. And so, inshallah, <laughs> one day. <laughs> and so, yes. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I, I'm learning for, uh, to be a good lawyer in the future. And I'm, I'm, learning, I'm learning for English, yes. I, I forget English. <laughs> yes. Huh. Good. Okay. And I'm going to ask a, a question. <clears throat> if someone if someone feels frustrated and they think it's very difficult to learn English, what advice would you give them? Uh, I think uh, I generally feel like that. And uh, when I feel like that, generally I choose to watch English film or communicate foreigners. They shouldn't uh, try to learn uh, grammar when they feel like that because you know grammar is a little bit boring actually <laughs> and so yeah when they feel like that they just uh, try to communicate with somebody it it would be their friends or foreigners and uh, yeah my advice is like that my advice is yeah okay wonderful okay well Thank, thank you for you. coming live. It was very nice to speak with you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Have a good day. You too. Thank you. Bye-bye. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Hello. <laughs> How are you? Hi. I'm wonderful. Thank you. And you? Great. Can I get your name and where you're from? Yes, yeah, sure. My name is Polina and I'm from Russia, Moscow. Ah, well, Strap Stoitia and uh, Spasibo for coming live. <laughs> oh, wonderful. <laughs> you have a Russian <laughs> language too, yeah? <laughs> In your lexic. Just a couple words. I see, как вас зовут? Is that right? That's right. It's absolutely correct. <laughs> okay, so today I'm going to ask you a couple questions and we'll have a mini conversation, okay? Sure, of course. Okay, all right. Uh, what is your purpose for studying English? Why do you study English? Uh, actually, I'm a kind of your colleague uh, because I'm an English tutor in uh, Moscow. And uh, my purpose, yeah, is to uh, teach my, uh, my students, you know, to uh, speak well and uh, to use it in uh, daily life. Wonderful. And do you have a specialization or is it general, all, all kind of English? Uh, you know, uh, I have a kind of specialization, but I use it only with uh, adults uh, at university. I go uh, uh, some degree in uh, law, um, uh, English, and uh, I practice it sometimes. 
Aha, uh -huh. wonderful. You sound very confident when you speak. Great, Thank wonderful. You. All right, let's see. Uh, since you're a, a, you know, a fellow tutor, a teacher as well, what yeah. advice do you give your students when they get frustrated, when they feel overwhelmed? It's like, ah, it's too much. What advice do you give them? Uh, you know, yeah, it happens sometimes with all students, and I suppose that among your uh, st students over here, they have also those problems, and uh, I prefer to tell them that they maybe need a kind of rest, maybe about uh, a week, you know, and then uh, during this week they can watch a series or movies, read in English, uh, practice it in a way, in a different way, not like on the lessons. It's my advice. <laughs> Uh -huh. And and what do the students think? Do they take your advice? Yeah, they usually take that advice, but uh, they don't want to stop uh, lessons, and they just do it in their free time. <laughs> sure, sure. One. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Um, do you have uh, a tool that you would recommend to English students? Uh, to learn, you mean English better. Right. Mm. A tool to practice it every day, for sure. Uh, with my students, uh, uh, the, I always tell them, students and the uh, parents of my small students, they know that uh, it's not uh, only my job to give them knowledge. They need to practice it. They need to use it. And if they don't use it daily, uh, maybe uh, they can use it every day when they cook or when they go somewhere. They need just think maybe in English or better to practice it with someone. And that's how they would know it better. <laughs> I like that. I think it's very important. I think sometimes, maybe not all the time, but sometimes the student expects the teacher to work miracles. <laughs> yeah. right? And the, the, te the teacher, we can do a lot. Ooh, we have great energy. But if the student doesn't want it, then it's not going to work. Ah! But on the, on the opposite, when the teacher wants it and the student wants it, wow, they can really make progress. Yeah. It's like a bomb, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. Okay, wonderful. Thank you for coming live and thank you for sharing your point of view. I appreciate it. Thanks. I wish a good day for all of you. Bye. <laughs> all right. Bye bye. Hello. Yo. <laughs> Welcome What's back. up again? How are you? Oh, uh, I'm doing good, as usual. Wonderful. Wonderful. Are you ready for our yeah. mini conversation? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. What? Let's see. Can you be as specific as possible? What yeah. is your purpose Inshallah. or goal? <laughs> Inshallah. <laughs> yes. What is your purpose or goal for learning English? And and if you say something like it's good to learn learn English, I will be disappointed. No, I won't. I need I more. Won't. I won't say specific. that. <laughs> I I learn English for having a better job. So I want to be able to have a job that requires English. So that's it. That's like my first goal. Uh huh. Yeah. Great. But th there are a lot of goals that I really want to achieve. Um, so it requires English, right? And I want to go abroad, for example. I want to marry someone from America and, you know, <laughs> and having a job in America as well and maybe becoming an immigrant. Maybe. I don't know. I just, I just want to, to live in a, in a different place, in a different country. Um, so, yeah. Uh-huh. So, are you ready for the, the difficult question? Yeah. Inshallah. <laughs> <laughs> Inshallah. Okay. So, it's common. We identify a goal, right? Something we want to yes. achieve. So, yes. we're here and the goal is over here. So, I'm going to ask you, what is your plan of action to achieve your goal? Um, I think it really depends on uh, what goal that we have, right? What what goals that we have. So, um, if let's say I want to have a better job, if if I want to ha to be, um, let's say a doctor, right? I have to learn everything about doctor, and <clears throat> I have to put 
all my effort towards this、um, job, right? To to really know how to be a doctor, to be a good doctor, or maybe if I want to be a teacher, I have to try to learn about how to be a teacher、um, to make sure that I'm going to be a good teacher. I'm going to、uh, make my students understand what I teach.、Um, yeah, so we have to. Know、um, the goals first, and then in order to be able to achieve that, you have to learn the goal. You have to put a lot of effort、uh, to be good at the job that you want to achieve. If that makes sense, I guess. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. I, you sound. I feel like you gave a speech. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Good. It's good. This is good practice. Wonderful because you have to think.、Uh, are you familiar with the phrase "think on your feet"?、Mm, not really. What's that?、Uh, it's. It means that you have to think in the moment, right? So when I asked、oh. you the question, I didn't say, "Okay, take ten minutes and come back with your answer." You had to answer、oh. immediately, right? So you're thinking while you're answering, right? It's yeah.、Good. Yeah. I'm actually trying to practice my English、uh, that way. You know, I I don't want to think that much,、um, so I have to kind of speak, 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 speak.、Um, uh, sometimes, you know, the answer is you know sound a little bit nonsense, but I have to, you know, keep thinking. And I think I'm pretty sure by having a little bit more knowledge,、um, I'm just gonna have to kind of. You know, mix it like my knowledge and my way of thinking, so that it will be like better.、Mm -hmm. Sure. You know, when it comes to yeah, speaking、sure. and and knowledge. Right, and the more practice, the easier it will become for our br our brain to think fast. Right. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to ask a question. We're I'm going to ask your opinion and ask advice from you. Okay. What, okay. What What advice do you have to other English learners? Who get frustrated? It's difficult. Ah, I want to give up. It's in, indeed English is is difficult. Like even when I talk to an American,、um, he said they said that.、Oh, I mean, she said that、uh, English is、uh, a, a quite difficult la difficult language.、Um, you know, compared to other languages, English is one of the most diffi difficult language. So、uh, because it is difficult, and I can feel it. Based on my personal experience, I watch a lot of YouTube videos. I watch a lot of movies, and that way you you are still learning while having fun. Just like what you said, it is correct. You know, you're you're having fun and you're also learning. And、um, also, like when you are learning English, you have to like it first. You have to like the language first, and then it will be a lot easier for you to understand English. So yeah, it will be better for you, rather than you know reading books. Because honestly, I hate reading books. Right? I hate reading books. Although it is very important, it is extremely important to、uh, read books. But I hate it. So I'm trying to find an an alternative way to keep learning、um, without feeling frustrated. You know. So yeah, I think YouTube YouTube is the base the best the best solution. But、um, again, reading book is important.、Uh, you should read books、uh, because I can feel it. Like even though I hate it, I'm trying to read books, and I I earn or I got a lot of new vocabulary. So yeah, I mean.、Uh -huh. But if you if you want an alter an alternative, YouTube is the best、uh, platform for you to learn English. Uh huh. Well, what you're saying it makes me. I have multiple thoughts.、Uh, one is that I think the challenge is we know it's going to be difficult. Can we find a creative way to do it and enjoy it, right? So、uh, yeah. if we're if we're able to go ahead, look like you want to say something. Go ahead. Yeah. So, for example, okay,、uh, a lot of people are fans of yours. For example, they like you. Okay, when they like you, they're going to always look up to you. They are always going to see your contents because they like you. And、uh, and fortunately, your content is about English. And because they like you, because you are speaking in English, they are always keep 
looking at you while learning English. So that is one of the best way, in my opinion, because I used to like a lot of people, um, like YouTubers, who are speaking in English, and I keep following them, and I watch their videos, and I watch their content, and I learn a lot from them. So, yeah, I think that is the best way, in my opinion. All right. <laughs> Oh, I think time is up. Uh, a lot of people are just okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. No, remember, this is like uh, a dictatorship. I get to decide how long. <laughs> well, yeah, but uh, yeah, <laughs> um, yeah, but I want to kind of, you know, sure, be wise I, a little bit. <laughs> I I appreciate your advice and thank you for coming live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, thank you for letting me in. <laughs> sure. Okay. All right. And, have and a by the way, I, I, have a, I have a question. One question, though. One question. So you, uh, whenever you stop live and you are, when you are going to start another live, you're going to, like, write something. So what is that? What are you oh, writing down I'm there? writing down everyone who comes live. Oh. Okay. Because okay, okay. if you notice, right after I finish my live, I, I do an Instagram story and I say thank you to mm, everyone. Mm, I see, I see, I see. Live, and I try to, uh, what do you call it? Uh, I put their name, so it's kind of like a shout out to whoever came oh, live. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I see, I see. So, so that's all question. I'm asking. You're the first person that, that's asked that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I keep saying it <laughs> all the time. Uh huh. Oh, so it's actually for you guys because I think it's a nice way to say thank you. So, because I learned yeah. from you guys as well. Okay. I got to move forward. Thank you for coming live. Thank you, sir. All right. Bye-bye. Right. I see the ceiling. <laughs> or is it the floor? Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. Good morning. You, you have you? a beautiful... I'm great. You have a beautiful ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm so sorry. I just woke, woke up. I'm so sorry. <laughs> No, it, it's okay. No, no need to apologize. Here we are. Are you ready to have a mini conversation? Oh yes, I am. Great. I see you're like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you, you can hear the, the uh, my my watch again. Ah. Because here, it's approximately uh, 10 a.m. So it's my Friday, my free day. Um, but uh -huh. I know that you're here, and I was prepared. So I just woke up. <laughs> okay, no worries. No need to apologize. Okay, uh, let's see. Here is my first question. Uh, hmm. Uh, I guess I'll repeat the other question from before. What? Okay. Why do you study English? What is your number one goal? Uh, my number one goal is is knowing people, is meeting people, is meeting places, is traveling around the world. Uh huh. So social. Yeah, yes, for social. Yes, I, when I was a, a, a young, I ever dreamed with uh, meeting people and traveling and meeting all the, the countries as possible. You uh -huh. know, I decided to start. Uh, I decided to start um, studying, interpreting, Asian interpreting between English and Spanish. So that's the way I started. Then I, I started to learn other languages, but my first goal is that traveling. Traveling and meeting people, meeting countries, that is the goal. Uh-huh. And can I ask you a question? Uh, did, you yes. study English in, did you study English in school when you were a kid? No, no. When, when I was no. a kid, no. Just in now, superior. Uh-huh. And do you find it more useful to study uh, like with books or with talking and meeting people? With talking, definitely. Because I, I studied uh, English three years and I try, I went to Brazil and I learned the Portuguese in five months. So so I lived there and I, I, and I got the, the Portuguese in a few months. So my Portuguese is better than my English and I studied that for two years. So it was easier the Portuguese because I went there and I went and I I was speaking all every day. So uh -huh. that's the best way for me. 
Uh huh. I agree. I, I think I told you before I studied in your country, right? In Concepcion. Yeah, yeah, yes. You told me. Right. And yeah, I remember yeah. when I when I first got there, and everything uh -huh. was in Spanish, twenty four yeah. hours a day. Right. My mind was like, pa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And yes. and yes. I slept. I slept really well at night because it was like my mental energy was like ah right. But it was it was the best <clears throat> it was the best way I think because I advanced so quickly. Yeah. Yes, quickly, definitely. Yes, I agree with you. Okay, can I get, can I ask you for advice? Yes, yes, please, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what would you tell? People that are learning English who are feeling very frustrated, or they're feeling like they want to give up. Oh, oh, that's a good question. And it may be what my teachers told me when when I was studying English. Is basically you you have to have fear. First of all, you won't fear because you you have you have to feel more confident. And one way is if To get more confidence, I, if you, for example, when I started to participate in your videos, I wasn't able to speak uh, fluently or whatever. But now this is the first, the third time that I I have participated in these videos, and so now I feel more confident. So first uh, advice is not to appear to 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 speak wrong. I think I, I I speak wrong most of the time, but it is necessary because you have to to love your fear in order to 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 learn some different things. So the principal advice is that not the fear and practice every day. There's no option. Uh huh. Uh huh. So okay. maybe just like Ni Nike says, they say just do it. Just do it. Yeah. <laughs> That is just do it. You you have to do it. And I heard a quote, something about confidence comes after we take action. We don't get yeah. confidence and then take action. We usually take action and then become confident. Yes, because because you well, first of all you have to start to try it. When you decide that you want to 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 start to learn. That is the best, the, the first way, the first step, as you said before. First, you have to 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 be decided to do it and start to it. When you start, as as well you said before, after that you will get the confidence. Uh huh. I like your advice. Thank you. No, thank <laughs> you too for receiving me. Thank you so much. I'm so sorry because I just woke up, but <laughs> <laughs> no worries. No worries. Do 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 I look like do I look offended? No, 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 no. So I was trying to participate in your videos the last maybe the last month, and uh, it was impossible. So I didn't expect that you you were to to say to me. That's why I just woke up and <laughs> you know. <laughs> uh huh. Okay. Well, thank you for coming live. I appreciate it, and thank you for having a conversation with me. Well, thank you, Michael. Thanks to you, and thanks for receiving me and having this conversation. It was really helpful. Okay, so if you need to go back to sleep, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much. Yes, now I can go go back to sleep. But I, I had a conversation. I had a conversation with you, so. It's I'm relaxed. I'm done. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Have a wonderful day. Thank you, Michael. You too, over there. Honey, All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.